What's good, Was Squad? It's your boy Was coming at you with another Apex Legends video today. Now, today is not like any other day in the world of Apex Legends. Today is a very eventful day, and the reason why that is, my beautiful legends, we have the Lost Treasure event, we have the Lifeline rework, we have the Octane buff, we have the Wraith nerf buff rework, the Revenant buff, the Crypto buff, the what? It's just so much stuff going on, and we even got these packs to open. You feel me? Oh, yeah, and also we got some lore and some data mine leaks and some all oh, it's a whole bunch of information going on today. So, uh, I thought I would start off with the pack opening first. So, without further ado, let's get into this video. Now, if you're new around here, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe to the channel for more Apex content. we grinding the 8k subscribers, and we're ever so so close. So, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe, drop a like, and share the content with your friends. And without further ado, let's get right into this video, baby. All right, I haven't seen anything from this event. All right. I haven't seen any other skins. So before we even open the packs, we're gonna go through the skins real quick. We'll start with the uh Mirage Epic Solar Flare. Mm. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Now this Bangalore skin is beautiful. It's beautiful. It's a nice little epic skin to rock with. Give her something new. She don't really have much to deal with. The epic, the epic uh hemlock skin. I like it. Alternate. Ooh, ooh. I am, ooh, I am your champion. This is a nice alternator skin. Plus, the alternator is getting used a lot. So, I really like that. This PK skin is nice. This wingman skin is nice. What we got? This was the banner. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. This was Data Mine Leak, and everybody thought it was part of the quest, but it's actually a banner. Wow. I like that. We get a new Revenant banner. All right, okay, buddy lost his mind. And we got a crypto new skydive emote. What is he doing? I what? Oh, let's rewatch that one again. Okay, I, I still think the best one he has is with the drone and he fly like a, like a, uh, like a wing. Now that's a new, that's a nice Watson. We got some charms. Okay, I like the chest. Ooh, I really like that one. I like that one. G7, oh my God, oh my freak. Oh, this is beautiful. This is so pretty. Yo, this is a fire G7 skin. I'm gonna have to get some gameplay with that. Uh, Spitfire, I am trash with the Spitfire, but this skin is lovely too. Most of the time they got legendary skins, their legendary skins always hit. Oh, this is a beautiful, oh, this is a beautiful R99 skin. Oh my, oh, this is, I needed something new to run with. That is beautiful. Prowler. Oh my, I'm, yes, take my money, please. Respawn, you guys always make the nice legendary skin. Oh wait, I missed the flat line. Okay, I'll take that back. This is, this is, nothing, nothing beats that season, um, that season four battle pass flat line skin. Maybe if they'd have made that skin, but made it gold or something, it'd have been fire. But nothing really beats that. Looking at this rave skin up and personal. I like it, I like it. Kind of remind me of like, like well, I guess marble goddess. I was gonna say Egyptian goddess, but then you think about it, they did make their statues out of marble. So I guess I get where they got it from, but it looks nice. It looks nice. You definitely can spot this Wraith skin a mile away. The Revenant one, we already know. I like it. I like how they put the jetpack in the back of the skull. Nice, nice design. Nice design, art team. The Gibster. Oh my God, this is a really nice one. And I needed a new Gibby skin. This is beautiful. This is magnificent. Oh, okay. Oh my God. I can't, I can't. My, my hand's a little jerky. The crypto skin up close and personal. The secret of knowledge. Um, Honestly, if they would've took the mustache off, this would've been a fantastic. Uh, I don't like the mustache. Uh, maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm being biased, but. Oh. All right. Yo. That figure, girl, go girl. Okay, I, I rocks with this. I don't think I'd be a lifeline main. I mean, after this rework, but hey, I still like the skin. The Watson skin, Outland Explorer. I rock with it. It is a nice skin. What happened to her booty? I take her, her booty. Her booty. Caustic Gas Buster. Oh, this is clean. I needed a new Costa skin too. This is clean. This is a beautiful skin. All right, all right. I'm excited about these. I'm excited about these, chat. Chat, I'm excited about these skins. These are some nice skins. 
Oh, and we get the um the beautiful Mirage heirloom. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna just keep. I'm just gonna do this. Boom. All right, and we're just gonna open up all 24. To get everything out the way right now, so we can go. We already know what we're getting. Uh, but I am excited. I think all the skins so far in this pack are really nice. Like the Mirage one, it may be not so nice, but every other skin is like nice like it's really nice who's this banner for uh sure so i'm excited about it i'm excited about this event i'm excited about the rework i can't wait to get a game on lifeline to see how this works because a lot of people make it seem like oh well, I got the Outland Warriors, so I, and I still think the Outland Warriors is the best Bangalore skin there out there is out there. Um, hopefully, they give her a new skin. I don't know, actually. I, I've looked at her Apex Overdrive skin the other day, and I'm on the fence between those two now: the Outland Warriors and the um, Apex uh, Apex Overdrive. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, which one is the, no? It's uh, it's not the Apex Overdrive. It's the Assimilation one that she had for that um, event. Y'all let me know which one y'all think Bangalore best skin. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to give you guys these pack opening. And um, just give y'all got my y'all guys my honest opinion on the skins. The skins are really nice. The skins are honestly, in my opinion, worth it. I think this is like one of the best events where every skin is pretty much fire. Like, I haven't ran in, like most of the events, like you'll have like that one skin like I, I forgot what event when they came out the with the um, when they came out with the um came out with the white pathfinder skin i forgot what event that was i didn't get that skin i think that's the only pathfinder skin i regret not picking up but the um it's like normally most events that will have just one skin that will be good and the rest of the skins would be like eh. so i'm excited I really like this charm. That's a really good charm. Then after we open up packs, we'll take a look at this store, and then we'll see what's in the store. Um, Cause you know, they normally give out event exclusives as well. Equip this. This is a beautiful skin. That skin is magnificent. That's a good alternator skin. I might have to just run alternator now just to get that, see that skin more often. But um, I don't know. I feel like Respawn did a really good job with this event so far. I mean, I won't lie. <laughs> These packs are expensive, bro. Like these packs are expensive and I blew the bank just for you guys to get you guys some content But I still like I think it's worth it like as crazy as it may sound like it's a free-to-play game and and It's and I understand every game is going towards microtransactions and I'm not trying to justify them being $20 a free and I'm not trying to justify them at all but what I'm saying is um I can't get too mad with it being $25 a skin, bro. Like, I can't, I mean, not $25. I mean, I can't get too mad with it being $20 a skin because, I mean, the skins are really nice. Now, what, what will piss me off, and I will be completely honest about this, what will piss me off is if they keep bringing back these skins. Like, make them completely event exclusive. Like, if I'm spending my $20 on this game, make them completely event exclusive like they're supposed to be bringing back the void walker skin for the summer now me personally i have the void walker skin i don't think they should bring it back maybe i'm being biased because i have the skin and maybe it's not fair to the people that just started the game but what i'm saying is if you're just gonna keep bringing back the skins why should i why should i waste my 20 dollars on the skin like you know what i'm saying like if you're gonna if you're gonna make an event exclusive skin leave it at that like it's an event exclusive skin you didn't get it you missed out sorry like it's that simple like i don't know that's just how i personally feel that's how i personally feel about the situation when it comes to these event exclusives like i was upset when they brought back the bangalore skin like i granted a lot of people didn't get to get it because they wasn't they didn't play the game i guess i can try this out i need a new skin. um I guess a lot of people wanted it back because they didn't get it. And like, granted, I was happy they brought it back because I got to get that Sunfire Pathfinder skin I missed out on. But at the same time, I wasn't upset that I didn't I didn't get it. And the reason why I wasn't upset that I didn't get it is because of the simple fact that the matter is, um, I had the opportunity to and I just didn't 
purpose you get the, the Pathfinder Sunfire skin. So it's like, it's like, and for the people that didn't get it, it's just kind of like, okay, well, I'm sorry. Like, you know, the people that dedicated to this game and played this game a lot, they earned it. You know what I'm saying? It's, I don't know. I feel like they should stop bringing back stuff. Woo! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got the heirloom, baby. We got the heirloom. Let's do this heirloom pack opening, baby. Let's go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go, baby. <laughs> the way he look at himself is so funny, man. Like, go, baby. Uh, all right, all right, all right. That is all the pack openings. Like I said, me personally, I enjoy every single uh, skin on here except for the Mirage skin. I think that's the only one I did not like. Now let's look at the store. Oh, we got some nice charms. All right. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. When it comes to these event exclusive skins, like I just said, I don't like this. Like, I don't care. You wanna know why? They're gonna bring it back when they ain't got no content. When they ain't got no content, they're gonna bring it back. So there's no point even wasting my money getting it now. Like honestly, some of them they they haven't brought back, but I feel like it will. Like the first time they bring the Void Walker back, so it's like why? Now I will get these charms. I do like these charms. Do need some more gun charms. That Gibby charm is fire. This Demon Mask, it, nice. And then this Gold Token is nice too. So I'm gonna get these real quick. And um, I think that's all I'm gonna get out the store. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this pack opening, hey, hey, hey. If you enjoyed this pack opening, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe to the channel for more Apex Legends content. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.